And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, and with me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And we have the first match at the Comnebol Libertadores group stage coming right up for you. This ought to be a fantastic watch, Lee. Well, thanks, Derek. This tournament means so much to the fans in South America, and it means so much to these two clubs as well. I'm sure they'll be both eager to have a strong start in this group and move towards securing their spot in the knockout rounds. And the lineup for the home side. Now, there has been some discussion about the style of play. Some would argue it's on the negative side. What realistically should we expect, Lee? Yeah, they do tend to collapse when they don't have the ball. They sit off the opposition, almost inviting pressure onto them before trying to open up when they do have the ball. I don't think we'll see any changes today in that approach. This is how the visitors will set up today. This particular setup is becoming more and more in favour. Yes, Derek, one central striker, two wingers will provide the width, a very narrow three in midfield, a back four, the two full-backs will be expected to support, but also defend and help out the centre-backs. And the game begins. Sanchez. Well, you know, most teams have a preferred way of playing. The visitors do like to press high. They try to force errors. Lee, do you anticipate seeing that from them in this game? Yeah, I do, Derek, I really do. It's a brave way of playing, though, away from home. It just shows the confidence the coach has in this group of players. A well, good idea, but overcooked. Well, sloppy in possession. Can he convert? Goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. I cannot believe he's kept that out the net. Absolutely amazing. So the corner played into the box. I must say he's let himself down with really flabby finishing there. Yeah, he wasted opportunity from the short distance. You see the manager's frustration on the touchline. Failed to keep hold of it. Moving it forward. A terrific pass. And a goal it is! No long wait for the opener today. Well, here it is again, and all the credit goes to the goal scorer. But you have to ask questions about the keeper. He's got to have that covered for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. One nil then. Sanchez. Montenegro. Dangerous looking attack. Well, nothing productive really. And there to intervene.
It might be on for them. What can he do from here? Well, they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Read it superbly to take back possession. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Sanchez. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Excellent ball over the top. Well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. Pejerano. Now they've lost it. Did look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Montenegro. He's protecting it well. Well, they no longer have the ball. It is a decent looking attack here. Looks promising this. Important facet of his play, holding the ball up and waiting for support. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Well, not to be in terms of the counter attack. And they've won possession again. Ortiz. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. He's got to score! And a pretty straightforward stop for the goalkeeper there. Yeah, weak shot straight at him, no problem for the goalie. Lorenzo Faravesi, perfectly positioned to take it away. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Intercepting it intelligently. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. He's in control of the situation. Could cross it in here. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. And the cross into the middle. Well, no danger now. Oh, what's he gone and done? The referee correctly decided to play advantage. He's very adept at protecting the ball. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. And the counter-attack is on, options available. Crossing possibilities. Can they get in behind them? Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Pejerano. Save. A big chance to get level. The crowd are going nuts.
And he's fired over the corner. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. And a tidy ball. It looks promising. And played in. He brings it down, but work to do. Wonderful block. Attending to his defensive chores. I must say, this looks promising. Well, not great defending. A sloppy pass. And a throw-in it's going to be. And time for the change now. Faravegi. Christian Pejerano. Possession one. Really well played pass. Cuts it back. And it's still on. Oh, you don't want to lose the ball in that position. Off the post and back in play. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Good defending to prevent the chance. And rattling the post. And this situation could be dangerous. Well, that's a well-timed pass. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. We're getting the ball forward. Poor pass under no real pressure. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Now he must favour the cross. Losing possession. Getting forward. Well, oh, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. Substitution time it is. Pejerano. Now Montenegro. 
And he's broken free. Can they get in behind them? Defended well. Counter attacking very much an option. Loves to attack from the wide areas. Throw ins given. And space to cross it. This looks promising. Precise ball movement. Fluency of movement. Can he put it away? Oh, he's found the net. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Well, this is definitely worth another look. Superb interplay, so slick, and the thunderous strike to beat the keeper hands down is absolutely brilliant. So, 2-0 now. The visitors' possession stats are brilliant. Really starting to dictate the tempo of this game now. And they're creating chances as well. I'm not sure their opponents seem to have the answer, to be honest. They can't seem to get a foothold in this game. Fine sequence of passes. Well, they've not been at the races today, it's as simple as that. The coach must be mystified. I know the crowd are certainly making themselves heard. Too many mistakes, not enough heart or endeavour for me. Well, not very clever defending. Oh, surely! What a vital intervention! Montenegro. Now can they counter clinically? Mera, Lorenzo Faravesi. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Could pull one back here. Which he does! And maybe, just maybe, there's enough time for an equaliser. It would be quite the frenetic turnaround. Well, in this replay, you're going to see a 2v1 against the keeper. How does that happen? He'll be asking his defence why he was left exposed, nothing he could do. Well, two one it is here. Well, it must be mighty annoying when you can't get near the ball. And he's through here. There it is! A fantastic goal, and no wonder he's off celebrating! Well, as we see again here, it's a beauty of a ball over the top. And once he gets himself settled with the keeper to beat, he hammers it into the back of the net. Smashing goal.
No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. from the keeper how can he take them on and beat them well that's a splendid piece of challenging and just the one minute left in normal time here and that is full time really the worst possible start you've got to say that's the last thing you need start of the qualifying stages you don't need a zero point Sally you almost need memory loss now to forget about that down to five games to qualify. And I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, obviously, first concern is do you win the game? They've done that. He played very well as well. He's got his goal. He nearly had another one as well. Hit the woodwork. His teammates will be very pleased with that performance.